The reason why I chose to do the Organisational Psychology program at UQ is because just the quality of the teaching is absolutely phenomenal. I got to gain experience from both professional psychologists and academics who are at the forefront of what we do in organisational psychology. The other thing um, that I found really useful about the UQ program was the fact that I got to collaborate with psychologists outside of organisational psychology. I just thought that was absolutely fantastic. Students who are eligible to study the Master of Organisational Psychology program have completed four years within an accredited psychology degree. Our program welcomes students who have just completed honours or who have work experience and really the Master of Organisational Psychology program is great for anyone with an interest in working within psychology, with an interest in helping people, individuals and also at the systems level. I chose organisational psychology as opposed to clinical psychology because I think there's so much diversity that the field offers. People do spend most of their time at work so I do feel inspired by the idea that we can create healthier, more engaging environments for people to work in. I'm just really motivated by the different variety of work that organisational psychology encompasses from change management, learning and org development, talent acquisition. I think there's just so much that the field has to offer and it's really evolving. Um, which excites me. The staff are amazing, they are the academic giants in their field. UQ has this amazing rich history in organisational psychology. One of the founding members uh, really pioneered a lot of the field. In the Master of Organisational Psychology program, students have the opportunity to learn in the classroom and then apply that learning to their practice within organisations through their placement program. The highlight for me of my time on placement was really seeing my work used in a meaningful way. There's this amazing moment where you walk into an organisation and you feel like you're a student who doesn't know anything and you don't have particularly much to offer. And then you begin talking to the stakeholders at the organisation and they start discussing some of the problems or areas where you could help. And you start to realise that what you've been learning in class is actually quite straightforward to apply in a workplace and suddenly you're affecting change in a real way. You're impacting the way an organisation is designing policy or running workshops or how they're training their leaders. And it's this really meaningful moment of progressing from just feeling like a student to feeling like a professional who's making meaningful change. My placement experience was so valuable that it led to a job offer and I'm able to be working there full time. Organisational psychology and the pathway of becoming an organisational psychologist is really flexible. Through the program, you learn systems level thinking as well as having those core competencies that actually give you that psychologist registration. Students in this program have the opportunity to learn and develop their skills in a range of areas, including training and development, learning and development, human factors, psychometric assessments, all skills which will help them in their future careers. I work with people who work in safety critical roles and making sure that they're safe at work. The outcome for that is that thousands of people every day are impacted by the work that I do. I think that's absolutely wonderful. 